stole a boat once. Uh, not a speedboat, that'd just be a bit crazy. He's just a bit of a live wire sometimes, in a good way. He ended up getting chucked out and trying to get into fights with bouncers and stuff. But we're sort of about three times the size of him, obviously. He would just fit in his pocket. Um, yeah, he just sometimes doesn't seem to have any boundaries. But so that's why we love him. Tommy's the amusing one to us because he's, he's, he's not technically funny, but he, he just does things that make us laugh. He very much looks at the world through rose-tinted lenses. He thinks he's highly evolved. There's too much going on in his head that he can't comprehend what else is going on in the world and then he, uh, he has to catch up with us. But then you get, uh, you get Dan's kind of everything's a bit of a, a bit of a joke, so it kind of grows and grows and, until you need someone to try and stop it, I think. It's a bit unpredictable. It's like a loose cannon. Um, but he's a, a lot of fun to have around. Um, sometimes a little bit dangerous as well. Um, he doesn't go down too well in a, in a crowded room. And Nick's probably the, uh, the brains behind the organisation. I think he's a kind of bit of a ringleader, a bit of a, you know, kind of keeps everyone in line or at least tells everyone where they should be heading. He can be a bit, a bit moody at times. Owen's definitely the quietest one. Um, he just kind of sits in the corner, anonymous. I think he's a bit of a, a, bit of a dark horse. Yeah, kind of like you know, Diddy Jones. Or something, or something. I don't really know what's going on inside his head, but he's... He's intelligent lad, he's cool. Doesn't say an awful lot, but when he does it, it's, it, it means something, it's important. Like. He, he stole the boat and uh, rode around on this little lake for a little bit. And uh, some security guards came up and wondered what the hell we were doing. And we told them we were rowing. And they said, OK. Got away with it, it's got free. Stealing car, car aerials and stuff. And uh, the copper just walked out and was like, Oi. Man, and dropped about 20 of these areas that we picked up <laughs> and uh, handcuffed, dragged away. Um, but they gave me a pot noodle in the cell, so that went all bad.